Petrol Hedro and Atkinson, who was an early adopter of the electric vehicle trend, has said that he now feels duped by it. However, the Black Hatter Star's issues aren't with the vehicles themselves but rather the environmental impact of their production. The 68-year-old car fanatic got an electric hybrid 18 years ago and his first all-electric car 9 years later. He wrote, Electric vehicles may be a bit soulless, but they're wonderful mechanisms, fast, quiet and, until recently, very cheap to run. But increasingly, I feel a little duped, the Mr. Bean actor added in a comment piece in The Guardian. He continued, when you start to drill into the facts, electric motoring doesn't seem to be quite the environmental panacea it is claimed to be. The problem with the initiative is that it seems to be based on conclusions drawn from only one part of a car's operating life, what comes out of the exhaust pipe. He was writing in response to the government's proposal to ban the sale of new petrol and diesel cars from 2030. He cited figures released by Volvo in the lead-up to the COP26 climate conference. They revealed that greenhouse gas emissions in the production of an electric car were 70% higher than in the manufacturing of a petrol one due to the resource-sapping lithium-ion batteries. Don't miss. Matt Baker recalls Grim TV job that made him physically sick, insight, Vanessa Feltz wants hot sex and adventure following split from Ben Ovoetl, insight, Dan Walker reacts as viewer spots strange issue on Channel 5 News, video, he pointed out that solid state batteries, which will revolutionize the game are years away from going on sale. He concluded that electric propulsion will be of real, global environmental benefit one day, but that day has yet to dawn. Aside from a love of cars, Rowan is actually fully qualified to offer his opinions on this. He studied electrical and electronic engineering at university before gaining a subsequent master's in control systems. Rowan's concerns about the environmental impact of motoring appear to extend to his characters. One of his most famous creations Mr. Bean drove a classic 1977 Leyland Cars Mini 1000 Mark IV in Austin Citroen Green, with the bonnet painted matte black. Last year a report from Classic and specialist vehicle insurance provider Footman James claimed that classic cars like that are less damaging to the environment overall than modern vehicles, including electric vehicles. Seemingly it takes 46 years of use for the average classic car to match the carbon footprint of an electric vehicle coming out of production. This conclusion took into account the limited use of classics throughout the year. This is in contrast with modern cars that are often used on a daily basis, while generating large amounts of carbon during their production. Melting